Alright, so I told myself I was only going to record if I managed to find the right, um, what do you call it? The right text dialog because I, I should probably introduce this as a new video because if this is the right dialog then I'm going to use this recording but so basically when I recorded Sunday the reason why there wasn't a video was because I recorded about an hour and 30 of Civ got on Monica's app story played for like not a long time like literally got on there was an alternate introduction which is why I'm trying to record right now but I'll explain why because I went on there's the alternate intro she said something like hopefully I come up with something soon and then I ended the video but during the finalization process of my video it crashed so I lost everything but I'm not really mad about losing the sieve I'm mad about losing the uh, Monica's after story uh, alternate introduction dialogue because it was on the lines of a uh, her asking whether we pleasure ourselves in why guys are into females' underwear, but I, I highly doubt this will be the correct dialogue, so I don't even know why I'm recording, because I literally have about 27 minutes of, like, and I didn't, this wasn't straight, this was, like, pausing and then resuming once I got another uh, alternate introduction. There was at least 10 alternate introductions I recorded, maybe even 12, just to, like, try and get the one correct text dialogue, and it never came up. So that's why I'm recording tonight. I did this all two days ago because I wasn't able to record yesterday because uh, I had an all-day event, so I couldn't. But I don't know. I guess I'm jinxing it by recording it. I don't even know why I really am. Just, I don't know. I just, it, that's. I guess that's how confident I am that this is the one, even though it's probably not. So pretty much I should re explain what happened because, like, this. The information you guys have is still on the basis of part three. Basically, we've reached the end. Now, when you open the door in the third part, she jump scared you. And then after that, nothing changes with that. And then when you knock, it's the same every single time. So all you have to do is listen for new dialogue, essentially. That's basically what it is. And I think it's been repeating dialogue, but it hasn't been stuck on the same one. It's been, like, cycling through. So... Yeah, essentially I'm just, what I do is I keep reopening uh, Doki Doki Literature Club until I get this screen with the alternate intro, click listen, and, and just hope that it's the dialogue, and it hasn't popped up yet, the one that I want to see. The one that I want to see should start with, like, Welcome Back, Raven, because I remember it's a surprise, because I'm like, Monica knows I'm there, but no, it wasn't. We'll have to see, listen. Nope, this is uh what it was the last time, so. What I'll do is, um... What I'll probably do is, I'm not going to resume this recording until I find the right introduction dialogue. And you'll know it is because I will, I remember what it is and I'll resume it. I'm not going to do it like where I record every single one because I have about 27 minutes worth of that and it's not, there's no real point uploading because none of it's interesting. It's just like all random crap. There was one interesting one where she said something like, Raven walks up to the door and presses his ear ear against the, uh, Raven walks up and presses his ear against the keyhole and she, or the door and she essentially narrated everything, but that's it, so I guess I'm going to knock. I don't think this changes the uh, next one, but yeah, just what I'm going to do is, and if I can't find it tonight, I have about an hour and 20 to look, because I really, I have to go to bed. I can't get like less than five hours of sleep, so. Yeah, so goodbye. Yeah, so if I don't find it tonight, then you won't be listening to this. But if I do, then I'll resume it once I find the actual correct dialogue that I'm looking for. So until then. Oh, my sweet Jesus Christ, I found it. Ah. You have no clue the trouble I went through to find this. This is it, this is it, this is exactly how it started. Welcome back, Raven. She doesn't realize we're here. I'm also taking pictures of this, because if the recording doesn't work, I'm not risking it. It's, it's, I've probably put in at least two or three hours worth of closing and opening the game in order to try and recreate this. God, 
I'm, it's like a fucking burden has been lifted on my soul just from achieving this, but you'll see why it's worth it and why I've went through all the trouble of re-getting it again. Also, after this line, I clicked open the door. You'll see why, but I have reason to believe if I knock, it'll actually be different than her saying, who is it, or whatever. But yeah, still, gee. That's, oh my god, wait for it. Would you like your dinner? Some, for the few who watch, some of you may know where this is going. Or your bath. Uh, Jesus. If you're wondering where this quote's actually from, or... Dot, dot, dot. Me. I have no clue what anime this is from. I just know that. I know. I recognize the video clip. And this is probably the most interesting alternate introduction dialogue. It's just so ridiculous. Because normally she talks about like programming stuff. Or it's like Raven inches his way towards the door. Or like he loves me, he loves me not. With the flower petal thing. I'm not sure you guys saw that or I got it on well I do have it on record because I have about the 27 minutes worth of dialogue or like instruction dialogue but I'm not going to post that it's really useless but what's the time as you can see it's been nearly an hour but finally fucking found the dialogue and got the screenshots uh Jesus this this is the, yeah this is in contention between the or what's it called do you pleasure yourself, or why are guys obsessed with uh, females' underwear? It's This is in contention with those. There's normally something after this. Oh, there is. All right. I just remembered this. Oh, Jesus, thank God I actually found this again. I don't know what I would have. <laughs> now I knock. I'm pretty sure this is where I knock. Oh, damn it, it's the same thing. I'm so d fucking disappointed. I expected it, because when I first did this line, maybe I should, no, because I opened the door and it was the jump scare, and I'm like, oh, maybe I should knock, and she'll be like, surprised, and be like, J and she'll like, I don't even know what the dialogue would be, because I can't even see the room, but, I don't know, but. Romero says I got the dialogue that, I've, it's, I, no, I wouldn't say, I would say it's been more than two or three, it's been like four or five hours of me opening and closing the game just to get that, but, I'd say it was worth it in the end, now that I finally have it, but, uh, Jesus, and I've had to delay recordings, not yesterday's, but today's for it, Sunday's recording never went up because it crashed, and, yeah, I actually have no clue where that, I'm I'm not gonna pull up a YouTube video of it because then I'll have to give the owner credit. I don't really want to do that because I'm lazy and putting stuff in the description. But also, I changed the music to this because this was the music I actually went back and looked at my alternate intro, the one before I got that live dialogue, and changed everything. Instead of saying like goodbye, I went I'm going to sleep because that's when I started saying I changed the music from '80s version to. Uh, I still love you. I'm, I'm not sure whether that actually did anything, but uh, we'll see. Monica should say, like, I'm out of ideas, but. Yeah, this isn't going to get uploaded today because it's 11.30. Well, it's a short video. It's only, like, 10 maybe minutes long, but it still took. The time went into it is easily more than any other video because I spent, like, no, I don't think I spent four or five. I spent more, like, three or four. The only R1 that had that much time going to it was the Civ commentary, which I'm still working on. Which, tomorrow I'm not going to do Civ commentary, actually, because... Oh, yeah. Because, um, I'm going to do Behind Closed Doors, because that's real... Like, I don't get any Civ views. I got maybe one view, and also the computer downstairs, for whatever reason, won't record the entire damn thing, or won't... The entire thing won't upload. So, I'm working on that. But, we'll see. Maybe it just needs time. You know what they say, time heals all wounds. Or at least all wounds that are healable. Because that's not a true statement, but... Let's just say goodbye. Now that... I am, I am actually going to sleep now that I did that, but... Oh, Jesus. 
Also, you might notice on the downstairs computer I changed the desktop background because I'm having guests coming over. It's not the thing I wanted. Oh, for my video, not tomorrow, but Thursday. I changed it to a very sweet looking picture of Darth Vader because I wouldn't call myself a Star Wars nerd, but I'm subscribed to a few Star Wars YouTube channels and he's my favorite character, just like about 50% of Star Wars fans, but still what you want? Nah, fuck it. I'll just, I'll change the downstairs computer to this like it normally is. Or you know what I can do? Let's go back. Let's go back to this one. Because I feel like relieved now. I can just... Yeah, let's go back. I can put... I have a fucking genius idea. What is this? Is this... Nope, that's not what I wanted to open. Will Steam even open? Because for whatever reason, it wouldn't open when I was on the dock. That's why everything's removed except these four. Alright, yeah, it's not opening. I don't know what's wrong. But, let's... I literally just closed Steam, please. Can you... Alright. How do I make... Oh my god, I'm destroying. So look, it's in her hands. Or well, no, she would be looking up, but... It's in her hand. And it's still here, good. <laughs> yeah, that's... Can I actually open up the game from here? I doubt it. Because for whatever reason, again, Steam isn't working. But... No, she's looking up here. It would have to be... Bang. Oh my god, I'm destroying the game. There. That's perfect ice eye level. Can we... I, I don't know what's going on here. But yeah, I guess you know what I'll do? Because there's time. And I, what I'll do is I'll explain everything that has happened in the, like, hour and 30 minutes that I played Civ Five. I'll pause until I get to them, but it, it should be, like, less than, or about 10 minutes of me explaining where, what, everything that happened. Yep. See you then. So, the goal I have in mind is to do this all before the laptop starts burning up. So... Beautiful. No warm music. That's a good. That's probably the first thing you can notice. I'll just go around the top and then I'll actually describe a position. I'm earning a good amount of science now, researching a nice tech railroad. Fairly far. Alright, that's just my friend. I text him about it. He says I'm weird, and I'm not going to deny that. But So I'm at obviously a few techs that I wasn't at before, mainly being refrigeration, plastics, uh, electronics, and railroad. Yeah, I've made a fair bit of progress. I'm running 103 gold per turn, which is quite a lot. I don't know how I am, but six trade routes now. I probably didn't have that before. Negative one happiness, I probably had that. Golden age. Oh yeah, I forgot you lose per turn. 193 culture, not bad. I went to Merchant Navy for exploration. So I'm, that's probably why I'm getting a ton of gold. Also, freedom. I got not only the happiness. Oh, well, no. I got the happiness. Oh, the laptop's brain. Shit. Oh, well. These were the first two I got. Then uh, this. Then I got these two. And then this. So I have all the happiness, tents, and freedom. And because I'm at high culture, I'm only at minus 29. I was at minus 40 for a bit. Also, I might have that. I still have the highest tiers in art. It's good. My faith, I'm getting a ton of faith. I don't know why. Oh, wait, I do know why. It's because the Danish capital is still mine. And they're the that's the capital that has all the... Oh, no, these are two faith wonders. Because I know I didn't build any faith wonders. What about this city? This city literally has zero wonders. It's... I don't even know. And then Delhi. Did Delhi have a... I know Delhi had wonders. Yeah, so all the faith is coming from the Danish capital. And then, let's see, I have a boatload of aluminum. No oil, because I'm using it all, obviously. Same with coal. It's turn 229, 1918, It's the end of World War One. Just gotta know these important dates. Let's see, what else? Demographics. Top in the top three, which is fairly good. Uh, third in GMP, not too bad for having zero external trade routes. First in land, 
that's fine. Fifth and soldiers, you're not going to be first and soldiers on a, this game mode. Even if I conquer the whole world, I probably won't be first. Seventh on approval, not good. And then third on literacy, not too far behind China. Espionage, I have... China asked to move my spy, so I moved it to Amsterdam, because that's ultimately the next capital I gotta take. And uh, of course, there's not nothing to steal, because he's behind me in tech. And I have my R spies in Vest and Marrakesh. I already show my social policies. Great works, that's not, I don't care about that. What's in the World Congress? Ban Luxury Con. As usual, Venice goes around ban luxuries. Look at all the non. Look at all the luxuries that have been banned. Oh, it's also a culture from World Wonders that's helping. That's good for again, like if you're against, if you're preventing someone from doing the tourism victory. Historical landmarks this doesn't really benefit me at all in any way. You should probably uh, look at how the map is changed. Um, I took Philadelphia back. I defended Washington from both uh, Washington, who is now out of the game, and from uh, William, who is severely crippled. He we sort of split up the Danish Empire. I'm pretty sure I took Copenhagen in the last episode. And then also I settled the, this is my oil city. I could have gotten these two, but I was too late to settle. I was waiting until I got happy, but. Cardiff, my entire navy is relocated here. Battleships, I've got frigates. I'm starting to get out my submarines. Because right now I just have my ironclads and my sea beggars in here. Oh, I'm going to rush Neuschwanstein. And that should hopefully give me a decent amount of happiness culture and gold so it's a really good wonder like I mean the wonders I normally go for involve infrastructure or science so like the ones I go for would be I don't go for Temple of Armist because it's too early same with Great Library I go for Hanging Gardens if I can Petra if I can then usually Statue of Liberty if I can these are wonders like these are my wonders that I go for I might go for another good wonder if I have the time, but these like are wonders that I would prioritize. And then the Hubble Space Telescope. This one is probably like in the lower tier where like I'll go for it if I can, but it's not like like it won't make or destroy my game. Well, it might, but it's not one that I would prioritize over every other thing going on in the game right now. So yeah, what else is there? I don't think Many other things happened. I'm obviously my... Oh, I also took Nimien, which I'm keeping as a part of my empire, because I can. I could have raised it and put a new city here, which would have been better. But I don't... I sort of need distance from my cap, I guess. Se especially since I have, I would have had that regardless, because of my massive culture that I now have. Um, Dublin is... Dublin's... Dublin is a great city. I'm surprised it, it grew this high, but yeah, definitely rushing this city, this is what, this was the make or break moment in my game, whether or not I got Dublin up in like the first part, in before Gandhi got his city up. I'm not sure he would have, also I have a few antiquity sites that I need, but, so I can build an archaeologist, instead I'll actually probably want, yeah, I'm gonna do an archaeologist instead. How many antiquity sites do I actually have within my lands? Because this is archipelago, so... I have one here on this island, Grassland Hill. Does this have a, even have a mind on it? No, I don't. I'm not sure. So one here. One here. Alright, what about Philadelphia? One here. Washington? Nope. Got rid of the Citadel for a farm. I think that overall it's a good decision. What about Copenhagen? Uh, nothing in Copenhagen. So yeah, I have four of those within my lands, so I'm going to want four archaeologists. I don't, I don't really need submarines. I don't think I do. Yeah, I'm not really sure I need submarines. So apparently I have tons of iron. I have four ironclads. Yeah, basically I'm just... What am I waiting for, really? I don't really know. I'm waiting till I. Oh yeah, I know. I'm waiting until destroyers, which I should get in seven turns, because I don't want to. I'm pretty sure ironclads upgrade to destroyers. I don't want to run around with like ironclads when I can have destroyers. Because what's the next tech after destroyers, really? Probably 
missile cruisers, which are all the way here. And even then, that's not a melee unit. The best melee ship is a destroyer, so I might as well just wait till then. Then tech. I don't even. Tr I'm, I don't even think I have to tech the missile cruisers. After I get destroyers, I can like do whatever I want. But yeah, I'll probably tech the missile cruisers. No, they don't even require aluminum. That's fairly nice. So yeah, after destroyers, then missile cruisers. So might as well just wait till destroyers, and then I'll send a destroyer and battleship fleet to take Amsterdam. I don't really want to bother with the R cities. Mainly because, the, well, there is one problem, like, oh, apparently Ife is going down. I think I might have to go all the way around, like, all the way up here, and then attack Marrakesh, because I'm not sure I can go down. But, yeah. What, and none of these cities are really useful to me. I was thinking Chicago might be useful, because it has oil and salt, but that's, I already, I'm already gaining oil. And I already have it plenty of battleships. I could always build a crap state here, but I mainly built I was thinking if I get a general I could general here to get take this oil, but it's not really that important. There there's other areas in the world I haven't explored yet that I can take. So yeah I'll actually no, there I think there yeah there will be a problem. I might have to take Breda. Mainly because there's uh, I need to move my units through but I guess I could always go around Chicago. Or maybe I can start going the other way. Yeah, that might not be a bad idea. Because before... Yeah, because if I go straight west, I'll hit Venice. And I'll, it'll save me the trouble of going all the way around. So yes, I might actually... I think that's a better idea. Instead of my original plan was to sort of just keep going east. But I think it'll be better to do the opposite. So I might as well... Yeah, I think that's actually not a bad idea. Double movement on close is insane. I hope it keeps that when it upgrades, which it should, but... And I actually, because I actually made changes here, I'll probably have to save the game. I'm just keeping my navy stationed here now. Well, actually, yeah, I'm going to have to take Amsterdam first, so I don't really know why I moved this here, but it doesn't really matter. Yeah. I think the game's going well. Let's see if I can build anything more useful. Uh, nope, that's still the most useful for happiness. Research lab. Yeah, it's the most useful in this city. A bank. It's definitely the most useful in this city. Especially since I'm two turns away. See, lighthouse. Yeah, this city. Uh, I don't even really have to look. Yeah, this city obviously is my catch, so. What else? Stadium for Happiness, yes. Stadium for Happiness, yes. I'm not even going to build hotels. Research Lab? Yeah, because I have max happiness buildings in this city. Except for Stadium Butts. Oh, I never checked this one. In the end, oh, Hotel. Hospitals give happiness, so yes. After this, I'll probably go for a public school. But yeah, everything's looking good in this game. I think I've pretty much won it at this point. It's nothing that can really stop me, but yeah, because now once I'll, all I have to do is once I take Amsterdam, just head west, which is the direction I thought I wouldn't go in, but it is so. What other cities need factories? Does this city, this city is a factory. This city does not have a factory, but doesn't really need it. This city is a factory. So it's only Philadelphia and Washington that don't have well and Truro, but that's not gonna be a factory. I I don't even know why I'm checking Edinburgh. So just also scroll up. Doesn't hurt. So yeah, so I might have to delete what other stuff can these cities build before factories? Alright, yeah, so I can still get a lab in a stadium in this city before factory. In this city there's tons of stuff I can get. So I don't really need to get, make room for factories in these cities immediately. I'd rather use them for, or well, one upgrade to destroyers, I'll be able to get factories because destroyers. Do destroyers take oil? Because if so, then that's be, that'd be a real damn shame. See, destroyers? No, they do not take oil. So, build as many as I want. So, yeah, I'm gonna end it here. Um, also, I have to save because I actually made like two movements this game. So. 
Yeah, so yeah, now I'm definitely done. And it's right before midnight. Perfect. Yeah, I made all my... That's basically the state of the game. There's not much stopping me from winning. So... Yeah, I'm going to keep it like this with Doki Doki uh, staying right there. That's like perfect view. Maybe it should go a bit higher, but... Yeah, it's about... No, it should go a bit lower. A little bit lower. I think that's... Yeah, that's... No, a bit lower. A bit higher. Yeah, it's about... Yeah, that's... Yeah, this is perfect. So... Yep, I guess that's it for tonight. You'll probably be... This will be uploaded tomorrow. Or, be, or that's what I assume so. And then tomorrow there will also be a recording of Behind Closed Doors. So, that's it for tonight. Uh, tomorrow it is then.